telling you, there's a better way. So you keep saying, but what happens when the power goes out or that terminal breaks? The truth is, nothing's more reliable than a guy with a bag. This is going to get you killed, Dad. Don't worry, I'll be careful. <sighs> He's gonna be the death of me. What was that argument about? It's my dad. He thinks it's his job to deliver the mail. It's my job. People pay me to do it. <sighs> it's all my fault, really. A few months back, I asked him to deliver a letter for me. One letter became two, then three, then four. He was so into it. For his birthday, I made him that outfit, just for laughs. I didn't think he'd become the Commonwealth's personal postman. Maybe you should just leave him be. Can't do that. It'd be the same as letting him die. Hopefully this thing I'm working on will make it so he never has to go out there again. What are you working on? I'd like to call it Terminal Mail, or T-Mail for short. You see, a few scientists over at CIT were working on a way to deliver messages electronically. You realize how crazy that sounds, right? Electronic mail, it'd never work. Given how often I pretend things get lost in the mail, let's hope for both our sakes it doesn't. Yeah, how'd you even read electricity? You'd probably need like special glasses or something. That's what they said about airplanes and cats in space. It'd never work. But it did work. The problem is, they could only do it if the terminals were connected. So they all had to be linked by wires. But the other day, I was reading one of those old Boston Bugle papers for fun. And one of the stories on the front page was about this chem bus. Thing is, the dealers were CIT students. And they were using terminals to make their deals. How would something like that even work? My guess? Same way Travis tells you the news. Only it's text coming into your pit boy instead of sound. The point is, we get those terminal parts, or better yet, some schematics, and we might be able to use them to make a network of our own. Where can I find these schematics? We can try a couple places. I'd start with the CIT dorms, then maybe the local precinct. I'll mark both locations on your map. You get me two working network devices, and I'll have just what I need. Hey, the amount of clutter here is embarrassing. <laughs>